I really don't need to make grilled cheese in my toaster. I can make it in a fry pan. It is currently 11.46 in the p.m. Do you normally do Black Friday sales? Never. Uh, maybe, a, a, sometimes I go out like early Friday morning, but never, never this midnight stuff. My love for sleep does not exceed my love for sales. We're actually gonna go across the way to the very Kmart that we went to on the Halloween special. Because they have face cloths, three for $1.75. And we also want to see if... If anybody actually gives a shit that, that, that Kmart is having a Black Friday sale. There's some indication of some... <laughs> something or other. You know, Staples is having a lot of trouble. I'm surprised that they have anybody. Uh, th this might be paid. They might have, like, paid people to come people stand People are buying here. label makers. They feel the need to line up. <laughs> <laughs> it might just be Yeah, it looks there. like maybe 20. Yeah. Can they hold this rabble? Look at all the staff inside. Chock full of staff. <laughs> Are you excited about the face clothes? <laughs> What'd you come out for? Believe it or not, a Christmas tree. Yes. Christ well, they, you were thinking about yeah, that. Yeah, they're, they're really good on sale. They're half off. No, you know why? Because we, I bought a big one, like, 15, it's almost 15 feet tall. The damn thing weighs over 200 pounds. <laughs> and I can't tree. carry it now from down so long. <laughs> I said, we only used the three years. I said, but I can't carry it, can you? <laughs> it's a nice little one. That's what I'm looking for. Well, I had a little one. Oh, yeah? But she said, yeah, that don't look like a Christmas tree. I said, what the hell does? <laughs> <laughs> so what, you, what did you th hope to buy besides face spots? Well, uh, they, they were having a good sale on heaters. Uh, they had little on heaters. What? Heaters? Like a little space heater? Oh, it's infrared. It's from Kenmore. Make sure. Yeah. It's got the copper heat exchangers, not ceramic. And then I'm looking for some Christmas lights, too. You know, I told myself, what the hell am I doing here? I haven't done this since uh, 1960. They're all over the floor. Oh, yeah. I saw somebody. Yep. I saw somebody's blouse come off them. <laughs> And, and it wound up in the box, and I don't know what the I, I'm getting out of it. <laughs> what the hell am I doing here? What are you getting? Paper towels. Paper towels. Paper towels. Paper towels. Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> if they have any frozen dinners, I might pick up some too since I'm here. I'm gonna need some cereal. Oh, I need cereal too. It's I, the young people enjoy it. It's about it. double. We were in my father's chicken coop sitting on perches with a, a sex education class. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> You tell me you fucked the chicken? Huh? <laughs> what? Oh, oh, we're moving. We're moving. Right. We well, anyway, it was a sex education class at a chicken coop. Oh, I see. <laughs> the Black Friday Rush. Oh, I think that tree is, is so ridiculous lovely, though. I think I'm going to get a real tree. Those ugly, tacky LED lights. They look terrible. Anything but Christmas trees, they're awesome. Right. Christmas trees, they look like crap. The color is, is wrong. It's, off. it's the wrong hue. Like the yellows are really weak and the blues are really overpowering. Gotcha. It was a 15 footer. You got it. We got it in BJ. <laughs> Scary. We need to box still. I do like the real. It seems official. I thought they were all supposed to be half off. Jeff's car is empty. Maybe they're not marked. Let us take you to that annoying price scanner. We scan. could take me to the price scanner. No? 2249. Bad price. No, no. sale. Screw the star. That's screw the cute. Santa. Screw the angel. Owl on the tree. The oh. secular symbol of Christmas. <laughs> the owl. John's slightly afraid that the face cloths are sold out. These are rugs. But uh, these are 399. These are eight packs. Two dollars off. That's not, that's not a Black Friday deal. $2 off $17. $2 off $2. A good At Black least 40% off. Yeah. At least. I'm just looking for the face clothes. Cheaply made. Yeah, they, they're, sh they're already shedding. Let's see if these are actually the ones. Do you need more doggy blankets? I always need doggy blankets. $3? Nice. $3? I will be purchasing two. <laughs> At three bucks, I mean, you might as well just stock up if you, if you consume them. This is not quite the right item. Yeah. <sighs> All right, let's go to the heaters. I really only need a small heater. What's the utility? What's the function here? Uh, just to, to take the chill off the bedroom, you know, because I usually keep the house temp pretty low, like 60 degrees. But sometimes you want just a little heat. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna scan this heater. 12 and a half amps. I'm gonna have to do the conversion myself. The thing is, I bought a heater in the summer from 1989 on eBay right. because technology of the past is often better. It was about $24. 
and I think it's a lot nicer than this one. It's a metal case, good solid heater. In which case, there's no need for another heater. Well, I have one in the bathroom, but you want to move around to heaters all the time? Right, you know, right. You gotta keep them separated. A face cloth. Nina, this is the one I just put down. There. Oh. <laughs> I have to go to the office, please. I have to go to the office. I don't trust the product. No, Kenmore? Not a good, reliable brand name? <laughs> well, it's, 20 bucks, I'm sold. Oh, I was gonna buy that $80 one, but it's too big. It's too much. Let's go look at the appliances. Even though I didn't come for them, Kmart actually has some good deals on them. This is the hall of deals? This is the row of appliance deals. 50 bucks for a microwave? Not bad. It's a great price on a griddle. But you know what I already have? A griddle. How about a $60 meat slicer? It's a deep fryer. A two basket deep fryer. Four. For unknown. 60. That's no deal at all. That's, that's standard internet price. That, see that Bella slow cooker, the triple slow cooker? I bought one of those here at Black Friday two years ago. It's now $29.99. At the time, it was $19.99 three wow. years ago. Look, I know some of these pans are on big sale. No one has come down this aisle. Didn't pan out. See, two bucks off is not gonna get anyone very excited about your pans. $16.99 to $14.99. Look, if you brought that down to $7.99, there wouldn't be any on this rack. See, I could kind of use this this pan because I have one from this set from Tefal that I kind of damaged by cooking too hot in it. But I don't really need the second one. I have one that's just like this is the same size, but it's half off. So do I buy it or not? Stick it a cereal and place blanket. Fourteen ninety nine for this stupidness. Yeah, you know, if you like this kind of thing, I guess it's kind of. This is the as seen on TV section. So they sell you things that you may have seen on TV. Well, I believe that's that's the actual. Uh, it's a company. You can. Oh, it is. Yeah. It was a complicated explanation. This heater is OEM'd from a company. And he just put the Craftsman name on it. And that heater sells at Ocean State Job Lot for eight bucks. So it's not the Craftsman brand name, but less than half the price. And this is normally $39.99. People really pay $39.99 for this heater. Johnny, I see a lot of people going for furniture. Futons, small couches. It's Kmart furniture, it's pressed board. If you need cheap furniture that looks good for a few years, sure, why not? Furniture is not one of those things you should cheap out on. I like my furniture to be, you know, robust capable of holding my, you know, myself. Mm -hmm. So I, I spent good money on my furniture and I'm quite satisfied. For this sign, do they have music and viddy? <laughs> um, this, it just reminds me of 1991 yeah. in the biggest way. I think it, it might be an element of 1991. I almost broke a stack of TVs. Now we've been seeing a phenomenon at a lot of restaurants we go to. Yeah. They just litter the place in them. Yeah, yep. Well, I mean, look at this one. This is 399.99 for a 50-inch television. There's no Netflix here. No Netflix. Two HDMI. And That's the, pretty basic. And the display itself. Yes. The it's TV's real. not moving. There's certainly no empty stands of TVs. There is not a midnight rush of television no. purchasing. How many generic RCA LED TVs does one need? Unless you're a restaurant and you decide you're gonna yeah. litter your ceilings oh, with them. Oh, they should come in right, they should be here right now buying these up. If that's their vision for their restaurant. Yes. When did Sony video games start to look like Sony Blu-rays? Look at this sad Nintendo case. Completely empty. Nothing from Nintendo? No offering. I have no idea why Game Up's not carrying Nintendo anymore. It's weird. The iPhone 5 thing fit my 5S. Yeah. She would do better on Amazon. You would do better on Amazon. Like a G6. Like a G6. Just a selection of audio boom boxes. It shows only a cursory understanding of current audio technology. Mr. St. Nick with Kelsey Grammer. Oh, come now, Niles. 20 family holiday movies. You've never even sort of heard of them. This is a strange new trend where you have like classic movies that have Blu-ray covers that are comic book themed and they've got one for Scarface too. I don't know if it's like, like universal movies maybe. I'm told it's good. I mean, I'm literally the only person who buys DVDs anymore. What a joke of a cheap bin price. They've really been trying to promote their tie-in program, in which you get points on your Shop My Way card, which you can also use at Sears. If you buy two Wii games, you get $40 for a future purchase. But you gotta be a My Way member, which is free, but you have to know that and know, sign up for it and know all the things. So those kind of deals, and this is the same thing. These like a 99 cent deal, because you get the money back. Kmart and Sears are owned by the same company. Huh. The Sears Holding Company. Is Sound of Music a Christmas movie? My favorite things was already a dubious Christmas song they started throwing awesome. in. Awesome. And then they just go ahead and throw in the whole yeah. movie. Hole in the whole shebang. I need to buy cereal. You know, 
Yeah. And I still have to keep the towels. I'm a little underwhelmed. I'm not abandoning my cart, but there was a time when I was close. If the heater hadn't worked out, the cart would have been abandoned. The scary dark mall. They had a big revitalization effort. And, and I don't know if you remember, but they had all these grand plans to like make it all glass ceiling. And they ended up just like putting a fake facade on the building that looked like the plan. It's it's a hall. It's filled with like local hair shops and like rent a centers. And a lot of empty storefront. Yeah. And an empty empty anchor, which is never good. The Walmart that abandoned itself. Yep. Look at these shapely male lower halves. Having just enough stomach to tell you you're not this good looking. It's slippers for Ernie for his birthday. Forty percent off. They meet John's criteria for sale. Yeah, they do. I love warm socks. Six times four is 24. Four? Yeah, no, no. Not worth it. Not a good enough deal. You know, now that no, we're just officially past Thanksgiving, it's totally okay to have Christmas music on your radio. I approve. Three dollars down from four dollars. So that's what? 25% off. And that's not good enough to you? Let me remind you something. You came to Kmart and you were disappointed by the candy sales. Then you left and you were bummed. Look, honestly, I, I keep my expectations unreasonably high so I don't buy too much candy. I'm gonna borrow Judd's cart. Cake mix on sale for Black Friday. It's kind of a good deal. Almost, almost. Another 10 cents. What have I been <laughs> I refuse. Wait, why? Okay, $4.69 for a small box of cinnamon toast cream. Four sixty nine. dollars Yeah. What day is today? Black Friday. And you call that a Black Friday price? No, they can't have everything on sale. That would just be too crazy. I never thought it would come to this. Hmm. <laughs> Big Play-Doh push. I loved Play-Doh as a child. Jump babies. Jump babies. I wouldn't buy any of these things. Uh, Monster High, I believe that they're kind of the darker version of Bratz, which is something else I don't know anything about. Is Monster High a TV show or is this just I a line of I think it's just a line of toys. That's weird. I wouldn't buy this for my, for my young daughter. Why not? They set unrealistic expectations of your month to high. <laughs> look at this. Our advertising has become our entertainment. It's yeah, it's, disgusting. it's it's fun to look at the corporate logos, yeah. I guess. That, and that's, identify them. We used to sing a song in grade school yeah. called, um, it was like, a Pizza Hut, a Pizza Hut, Kentucky Fried Chicken and a Pizza Hut, McDonald's, McDonald's. Do you not remember those? We would make golden arches with our hands and stuff, and we would make little pizzas and stuff. Tanya. It's cute. We did it in the library. My, my childhood was also filled with uh, that awful uh, Comet Makes You Vomit song. Comet. It tastes like gas. It smells like gasoline. Comet. La, 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 la. I don't remember it. I'm old. Fighting terrorism. Yeah. Tactical Guns. mask. <laughs> I bet kids love that, though. Looking at these spy gear products... The, the young people on these look far too old to possibly want to use. Yeah, he's like college age. <laughs> oh, look at that old dude. He's cool. Oh, man, I want to be 43. He's got a receding hairline. <laughs> Christian Bale. Little sleeves so you can make grilled cheese in your toaster. I really don't need to make grilled cheese in my toaster. I can make it in a fry pan. For five bucks? Jeez. You know how many grilled cheeses I can make for five bucks without those? I think it's time to say goodbye. Yeah, I think it's time to say goodbye. I'm so sad. Let's go check out. We'll predict what everything costs. It, it, it's so easy. I, Nina has way more stuff in the cart than I do, so it's only fair that I take my meager item out of Nina's cart. So then, Nina, it's your job to predict how much it all costs. Are you serious? <laughs> it's, it's not as easy as you think. Twenty-nine fifty. Four aisles are open. This is the most aisles I've ever seen open at this game. She's bought a lot of fleece crap. Gifts for teens and forty plus men. I'd move to another aisle right now. The men are just involved. Pierce's salted nut roll. This is a not made by the Hershey's Corporation. A Pierce's salted nut roll. I've had products like that that are terrible and disgusting. They're taking out a mortgage on the side. <laughs> Oh, we're already over my estimate. I am not as good at this game as John is. 25.97, it's gonna ask you on the door to take you. Could you just answer that question? That's a big mess up. John's a little embarrassed for you. <laughs> Success. Goodbye, Black Friday. Would you ever come back? To Kmart ever again? Yeah. On, a, on, a Black <laughs> on a Black Friday. Maybe. It was fun. Didn't find anything today besides this little heater, but you know, in the future, maybe. Who knows?